got a good pistol grip coming over and up, okay, right up underneath the, his armpit. This foot's on the outside, this foot's gonna come up on the inside, under hook, okay? And then as I turn this way, I'm gonna lift with the thumb. You have to really commit to this, like pretty much any reverse throw or any lifting throw, you've got to commit to it. Uh, and the second thing I'm seeing a lot is a lot of reaching. So you're either reaching with your other underhook after you get the weave, okay, or you're reaching with your thigh because you're not committing to it. So the idea here is that when I roll through, okay, this leg is gonna go first. My other leg is already outside. My sweeping leg is here and ready. If I was in the middle, I'm screwed anyways, okay? So I'm never gonna get that from here. I'm gonna have to try and look that way, okay? Or do simulation. Or do simulation, yeah. I mean, yeah. But if I'm trying to actually do this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, so keep it on the outside. Don't worry about taking a step with this leg, okay? You're there, you're ready to go, okay? All you have to do is just let him make contact with that. So start the weave, and as soon as you're coming up, that foot comes up the middle, and then dig the underhook, okay? And now I'm ready to go. I'm underneath them, my knees are bent, my back is straight, and I've got him lifted up on his toes with the elbow weave, all right? And then notice where my leg is. Like, if I can tap him with the side of my knee, you got it. So all you gotta do is turn and lift, okay? And the whole way through, we were chest to chest because I committed completely and I didn't reach for anything. I didn't reach for the underhook, I didn't reach for the elbow weave, I didn't reach for the thigh. They were all in place because I committed and I stepped in. So if I do it this way, I'm not gonna throw it this way, okay? So you guys can kind of see, again, foot's already on the outside, I'm fine right here. I don't have to be that close. I could technically do it back here, okay? I'm just gonna have to pull a little bit more on the arm. All right, and then as this comes up, this steps in and the underhook goes last, okay? Step, underhook. And see this knee is still here and I can still make contact. So I can still throw them. So don't reach with the leg, don't reach with the underhook. If I weave and I start reaching for the underhook, he's gonna grab that, I do this, and then he's just gonna tackle me. Let it come to you. Yeah, okay? Let it work. You have a very natural shot in off of the elbow weave. Let it happen. Okay? Last thing, don't stick your leg straight. Okay? This isn't a sasai, it's, it's a, a thigh prop. Okay? If you try and stick your leg straight, you're going to make space in the hips, and that gives them an opportunity to turn out or to flatten on you. Okay? So if I weave again, and I do everything else perfectly, and I go through here like this, and I do that, See how he's just stepping around, okay? Because when the leg is straight, you're trying to make contact here with the foot, and it's not anywhere close to that. Thighs are close, lower part of the leg isn't. So keep your leg like this, okay? So weave, step in, underhook, okay? Start the lift and lift the leg. Everybody got it?